So what is going on guys, this is Reslek here, and welcome to some Dying Light. So Dying Light is a pretty fantastic zombies game, it's made by the same people who made the Dead Island games, I believe. And it's pretty much Dead Island, but with Parkour! and way better combat. Anyways, hell you Oh, this is a bad idea. Hold on! Oh, wait, where am I? Where am I? Ow, what the fuck happened there? I was falling, and then I grappled the air. I think, and then came over here. Let's go. Come on. I died. Why did he not use the grappling hook? Oh, hi, zombie. You're just chilling. Hey, you going? Oh, shit. Oh, this is the exciting part. I think it's starting to quickly turn to nighttime, which is when the volatiles come out. Oh, they're coming. Hey. Drop kick. Ah. I think I missed. I can't wait for the night time to hit. The, the night time is the best part of this game. Alright, we're going. I could have just used the grappling hook, but I chose not to. Okay, as soon as it hits night time, we're going to see how long we can survive with the volatiles. Also, it's a bit scary because if you watch my Minecraft videos, you know that when it's dark, for some reason, um, like, even though I can see, when you watch, when I watch the recording, over it just like it's so dark you can't see anything so i hope that same rule doesn't apply to this it has become night time the volatiles are gonna be somewhere they don't come to the light i don't think we must get away from the light make some noise let them come to me this is 100 percent a suicide mission right now just begging for the volatiles to come to me oh i know how to lure them out <laughs> oh this is gonna suck well, I didn't survive very long. Fantastic! Kyle Crane has spent so long in this quarantine zone that he has actually become very crazy to the point where he wants to confront the volatiles head on. Gunshot! Yep, they're gonna come. Ah! Oh, there's a volatile, like, right there. What are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, no, no, don't come. Don't come. No, I don't like that. Volatile? Are you near? Okay, I'm gonna go up here. For starters. Where is he? Oh, uh, no, that's not him. Where'd he go? Did he- did he go away? I wanna actually, like, get chased. Cause I'm crazy. Oh, ah! Holy shit! What in the hell was- Are they coming? Oh, they're gonna be coming now. Ah! Yeah, keep going. Keep going. They're not coming, right? No, they're coming. They're coming. Ah! Are they still coming? Yeah, they're still coming. They ah! Are they touch? Are they actually behind me? Wait, there's a button to look behind. I, I don't know what the button is though. What's that sound? Ah! I just I can't even see it. I can just hear it. Oh, I got away. Well, that wasn't scary at all. <laughs> hey, how you going, buddy? Wait, I need a health kit. Don't come over here just yet. Don't do it. Hey. Don't come up. Where'd you go? The fu no, don't do that! Where'd you go? So yeah, if you've never played Dying Light, this is basically it. It's just zombies, parkour, try to survive nighttime. Because when you're just out during the day, the zombies are fairly standard. You have the ones that walk, and then you have the runners, which, as the name suggests, they run. And you have a couple of other types. Like bloaters and stuff. Oh, maybe not bloaters. I think that's The Last of Us. But you have zombies that explode when they come towards you. Ones that throw acid towards you and stuff. And they're just fairly standard. But it's when you get to night time and the volatiles come out. Every time you shoot, you like, I'm only shooting so I can lure the volatiles out. And make this intense. I don't know if... Oh, there... Yep, it's still night time. I was about to say, I don't know if it's still night time. Here's the volatiles. Hey, buddy. Ah! Fucking! Out! Well, he's dead. Any others? Ah! Oh! No. No! I don't even know what happened there. I think even if you had a super modded weapon, confronting the volatiles head on, not a good idea. Which is why we're going to do it again. <laughs> They're gonna come for me now. And I love it. Wait. That's not a volatile. Get off my roof. Oh. There they are. Come on. I'm ready. God damn it! Nope. Ah. Oh, um. So it saw me and jumped off the roof by accident. Oh! Oh, there's multiples. Ah! Eh. 
I could really use a health kit right now. I can't believe it's still night time. I think by now, night time would have been over. We would have been back today. I don't have any ammo anymore, so I can't lure the volatiles out. So I don't even know what the release date is for Dying Light number two, but I know that that's happening. I, don't, I can't tell if it's going to be a next-gen exclusive or if it's also going to be on PS4 and Xbox One. But all I really want from it is, even though, like, the parkour and the combat is really good in this game, I would love it if they showed even more improvements in the sequel and made the volatiles even scarier than they already are. Ah! The Q button helps you find them. Okay, I gotta just do the thing. Shoot it! Here, come to me! Hmm. Hey. Oh, it's a, it, it knows exactly where I am. Where is it? Is it coming? Oh, they're just looking. No, he, no he's coming up. Yep, so it's starting to go to daytime. And the volatiles, they go right off back to their little hives. Because they cannot stand the sunlight. So anyways, that's going to do it for today's video. Thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed watching me play a little bit of Dying Light. I do apologize in advance if you guys were hoping to see Dying Light the following instead. Because I actually do have the following. I just chose to play the standard game today. But I may just consider doing the following as well if I get any requests to do so. But in the meantime, if you like the video, please drop a like and hit the subscribe button down below. And I'll see you all in the next video. Yeah. Goodbye. Epic kick! <laughs> Bye sucker.